हेलो वर्ल्ड वेलकम टू कोड आर्टिजन लैब सो दिस इज अ थर्ड पार्ट ऑफ अवर जेंगो ट्यूटोरियल सीरीज एंड इन दिस सीरीज वी आर क्रिएटिंग अ न्यूज वेबसाइट सो इन दिस पार्ट वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द मॉडल रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन न्यूज मॉडल एंड कैटेगरी मॉडल वी विल डिफाइन रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन न्यूज एंड कैटेगरी मॉडल वी विल ऑल्सो क्रिएट अ कमेंट्स मॉडल एंड क्रिएट अ रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन कमेंट्स एंड न्यूज मॉडल so here i have defined all the models so here you can see that we will uh, we have already created our category uh, model and in this part we will create news uh, model and we will create relationship between news and category with foreign key and we will also create comments model and define the relationship between news and comments model so in this part we will discuss about relationship and model so let's start so first of all go to our terminal and go to the project folder and actually we will not go to terminal we will go to our models.py our application in application main application models.py and here we will create a news model so news model and in this we will create news model start model and our title will be character field and maximum length i have defined 300 character and i will also define image and this will be a this will be a image field and it we will upload it to <coughs> images folder and we have also news detail models dot text field and we will also define our news add time so here we will define models dot date time field and add add now equal to true so this field will automatically add the current time in the table so whenever we will create a news then it will automatically add the add uh, add time will in the add time column uh, current time will automatically save and now we will define a relationship so here i will define a foreign key relation or you can say many to one relation because one category has many news so we will define many to one relation with foreign key so here i will define the first argument will be our model name and the second argument i will define here on delete so when this category will delete i will cascade this it means when our category will delete then all news related to this category will also delete and now i will return this i will define a function and return self return the news title so here i have defined the news model now we will migrate this so first of all we will create a migration file so migration file has been created now we will migrate this file manage dot py migrate so migration is also created now we will run server now one thing uh, we are going to do we register our uh, register this model in admin so what will we do first of all we will import the news model and register this news model here 
so here now in the in the second part we have already created an admin panel so now we will check the admin panel i will log in this so here you can see that we have uh, categories and we have news but the plural name is not uh, right so we will uh, define uh, we will rename it we, we can rename the plural name so what will we do we will use the meta options so in the model we will use meta so here we will for boss name plural equal to categories and uh, we will also define this name in our category model actually this will this will be a news so now we can check this so here you can see that we have renamed it so so let's add some news so here you can see that we have a new uh, category in a drop down because we have defined the foreign key relationship or many to one relationship so django gives us uh, more options uh, in uh, when you select this then edit option will be enabled you can add category here so i will select the sports and add this is this is sports news and i will choose the image this is not sports image but i will choose this and add this is sports news detail so let's add this so yeah if we have added the news now one thing that uh, we will do we will show here the title and add time also so how we can do that so we will do this in admin.py so open your admin.py and we will set, uh, we will do some changes in our news model view in our news model view for admin so what will we do we will create a class admin news so this will be anything so i have defined admin news so that it is related to our news model so now i will define admin and i will extend admin model admin and here i will list display so let's list display will uh, what do so first of all title and then category and then add time so I am showing the three fields. So now I will register this with model. Now we can check this. So now we have category add time also. So we have uh, showing the uh, category title and add time here. Now let's go to define our comments model. So in the comments model we have uh, news uh, news relationship uh, and the name that who is commenting the email who is comment the commenter of the uh, comment e comment email of the commenter and comment message and the status so status will do here uh, it the status will be by default zero so when admin put the status one then comments will show on the news detail page otherwise it will not it will not show on the detail page so this can be uh, this will uh, stop the spamming so let's define the comments model so here we will define the comments model class comment and we will define models dot model And the first field will be news and it will be a models dot foreign key and it will be a news 
and the same when news will be deleted then all all comments related to this news will also delete and the name so name will be a character field and maximum length of the name will be 100 and the next is email so it will be also a character field so I will give this length 200 and the comment message and the comment message will be model start this will be a text field so we can define more text and the last one is status so status will be our boolean field and in boolean field we will default we will define default false and now we will return by default that we want to return that we want to return the we want to return self dot comment we want to return comment message default and now we will add this in admin and we will also some uh, do updations in comments that what we want to show in admin panel when you uh, when admin go to the comments section or comments model so first let's to my uh, let's migrate this so i will stop the server and create manage.py make migrations so our comments model has been migrated uh, not migrated migration file has been created and now we will migrate this so comments model has been migrated now we will run the server and now we will do the other things we will define here comments and first of all we need to load it comment and we will also define the we will also do some updations for comment so i will define here admin comment admin dot model admin so i want to show i want to show the news so here news will be return title of the news and i also want to show uh, email of the commenter and the comment message yeah so this is fine now which uh, we will go to our admin section and check this so what is wrong here so we need to restart the server and we will check here again so comments model has been registered here when we click on this so let's add comment so i'm going to so this will be a john john at the gmail.com i am very cool so status status i by default it will not check so here you can see that we are showing a news title email and comment so I will show the status also that comment has been approved or not. So here we will see. So status is showing now. Now we will check this status and save. So now status is okay. So in this part we have defined our all models. So I hope you, you enjoyed this part. In the next part we will fetch the data in the templates we will create templates and uh, fetch the data and show the categories and new section so thank you very much so if you like this channel and it uh, it is helping you then please subscribe and share this channel thank you very much